farmers. Bum, ba, dum, bum, 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 bum. That's right, folks. It's going to be a pretty close game. Warm, warmer, and... Hey, number 28. Don't act like we didn't see that. Get to the back of the line. I, 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 I don't know about you, Milo, but my money's on number 15. Going once, going twice. Oh, Joel's going. Joel? Joel, mama. Oh! Who's doing that? If it were up to me to assume, I'd say it's those two troublemakers again. I thought so. Well, that's the last straw for those boys. Hey, Milo, want to hear this really funny joke I read online? It's not stupid, is it? No, it's not stupid. All right, so listen. This couple walks in their bedroom just like any other night, right? And the man, he goes and sleeps on the bed with a woman. For some reason, she's blazed on the floor. And the man asks, honey, why are you sleeping on the floor? And to which she replies, because I want to feel something hard for a change. <laughs> <laughs> you two come with me now, aboard. You two get back here. And Joel, what's up, my dog? So, what were you two up to last night? Oh, we had a blast last night. We almost lost the hands of Mr. Keen, though, but other than that, is all we ever hoped for. Yeah, I really wish I was there with y'all, but... Yeah, 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 you went to school presidential campaign. Why do you even attend? School politics are boring. Politics in general are boring. You should have been with us last night. Well, be glad I was there, or else I wouldn't have this information. You know one of the candidates is Rosetta Williams, right? The pretty girl with the smarts? Yeah. So what? She said once she's elected, she'll ban with the administrators and put stricter rules on this place. And one of her biggest targets is the troublemakers. That being us, y'all. No big deal. It's not like anyone's going to vote for someone like that. they would rather vote for our boy Cooper. But that's the problem. She's the most popular girl in school. And most of everybody's on her side. But this can't happen. She's going to doom us all. For once, I agree with you. Sit back down, all of you. I'm just as against this as you guys are. If we don't do something, we'll be in attention for the rest of our days. How can we do anything at this point? Election day is literally a week away. Simple, we make sure Rosetta doesn't get a taste of that sweet victory. Give me some time though, good ideas don't come immediately. By the way, Dylan, you shouldn't leave your phone out where others can access it. Oh, my wallpaper. And remember, a vote for me is a vote for a better life. In this box, there is exactly 613 votes. I couldn't just give Cooper all the votes, I had to be consistent. So I gave Rosetta some, but not more than him. Pretty smart. So I'm guessing the other box is for disposing the defects? Exactly. Now here's the plan. I'm gonna be in the gym watching the debate. You are gonna be watching the hallways, and you two are gonna swap the votes. Mind you, they moved the votes to Mr. Keaton's room, so... Oh hell no! Can't go into Mr. Keaton's room. He'll suspend us just for walking in. Besides, the man's in there 24 7 well, we'll have to think of a way to get him out. I've got an idea. <laughs> you know, I, I don't understand your motives here. You want to get rid of the undesirables? What are you implying with that, huh? It seems like you're having a hard time trying to understand. I've already explained it. Well, and apparently repeating yourself is too much work for you. <laughs> I'm still waiting on you to make a valid point for the terms of your presidency. Mr. Keaton? Yes? There's a student in guidance that needs to see you. Uh, okay. I'll be right there. Well, maybe if you would give me time to speak, I would make that point. 
All right. Go ahead. Speak. Thank you. My point is that I believe every student should have the- Rosanna for school presidency! That was uncomfortable. Go back. The election isn't until tomorrow, so maybe I still have a chance to- Rosanna for school presidency! Joel did not think to steer all the way. Hi. You're the one that wanted me? Uh, I'm Adeline. Hi, Adeline. And why did you make me come all the way to Guidance? Um, I will... Yeah... I have a list of teachers I'd love to sit down for an interview. You're on that list. And you think that's worth more of my time than grading papers? Yeah? Well, it's not. Make it quick. What are you three up to this time? Nothing to get suspicious about. We're just, you know, paying Mr. Keaton a visit to apologize. Yeah, I'll believe it when I see it. it it's, it's very sentimental. I wouldn't want you know, those glasses of yours to get blocked up with tears. Tanner! I knew you threw up something! Oh no, I don't. Get him, Joel! Let's go, Joel! Yeah, yeah get him, Joel! Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Tanner, you son of a bitch! Oh, well, I can do that too, Rosetta. It's either your lack of enthusiasm or your lack of an audience. <laughs> you think you're so funny when you do that. Because I am? Yeah, funny looking. Listen, you are only here because of your popularity. That is it. Mm -hmm. Then why are you here? Because I'm too good looking not to be. Okay, keep telling yourself that. Come on, Tanner, I just want to talk. Tanner! Where's Mr. Keaton? Hold off, please. He went up to guidance. Tanner! Get off me! What was that? Nothing to be concerned about. Sounds very concerning. What are you doing? Oh shit. I've taken this prisoner hostage. Stand back. I've got a gun. This is bad. This is bad. Tanner six is losing everything. Now look where it's got us. Can we just put them back in? No, it's not. Fifty, fifty. Popularity always wins. The, the heat made her. You two, come with me now. Look, at this point, it would take a miracle for you to. Sorry, everybody. To interrupt, I have some very unfortunate news. These four idiots tried to sabotage the school election with false votes. What's worse, they failed miserably, spilling all the votes on my classroom floor. Well, Rosetta, uh, I've considered you many things in the past, but never did I think that you would rig a school election. Excuse me? Oh, don't act like you don't know. You hired those four dimwits to rig the election for you to increase your chances of winning. It's more likely that you did it. You knew you had no chance against me, so you went off and you sabotaged the whole thing for your benefit. 
Ah, yeah? Well, uh, say what you will, you botched it anyways. <laughs> That's it, bucko. You asked for it. Oh, I'm so scared. <laughs> Enough of that! So why did you do it? So that's how we're gonna play it. You just got yourself a month's detention. You're gonna clean every classroom floor, starting with this one. As for the two of you, they won't spill the beans, so we don't know who won. You're both punished. And the election? Canceled until a later date. Thank you. Now you four, you have 10 seconds to get out of my sight before I bump up your detention another month. One, two, three, four, five, six, nine, 